Hey folks, welcome back here to the Vegas Don channel. We're here on Kyle Canyon Road, heading up to Mount Charleston. We're under an extreme fire warning right now, red flag warning until uh, later this evening. It's been really, really windy here in town. Do not pass. The sign is up here. Next two miles. This is a very popular place for a lot of tourists to come up here, kind of get away from the hustle and bustle of the Strip and Fremont Street, come up here and hang out. Deer crossing next seven miles. You can kind of come out here and just experience nature. There used to be a, uh, a little restaurant up here. People would drive up here and come up here and have a meal, but that restaurant caught fire. They're supposed to be rebuilding it. I haven't been out here for a while myself, so. Um, not sure what the progress is on that reconstruction. We've got uh, someone just dropped down to 40, no, 35 miles an hour here. I don't know why we're going so much slower than the 55. But it figures you enter a no passing zone, there's always going to be someone. Making everyone go slowly. Do not pass next one mile. Typically during the, uh, throughout the year, this area, Mount Charleston, to be about 25, 30 degrees cooler in, uh, up here than it will be down in Vegas. So it's a good getaway for folks down in Vegas to escape the heat come up here as well. Starting to notice more green on the sides of the road as we come up here, hitting 6,000 elevation. And uh, looks like a little Honda Accord or Civic up here in front of us that's uh, being extremely careful negotiating these turns at 35 miles an hour. And just a word of advice to folks, if you're ever on a mountain road like this and you have cars behind you and you're the lead car, and you notice these folks are behind you, just pull over for a second, please. Let them go by you. You're not losing anything. Just a friendly word of advice. I've seen it result in a lot of unnecessary stress for people. The sign over there says icy. And then you have, of course, the, the road rage folks out there that'll uh, Start raging. Middle Kyle Canyon administrative site, it says there. Fire danger, extreme today with Smokey the Bear. Spring Mountains visitor getaway, it says there. Got a uh, police unit. Looks like a highway patrol unit pass passing us the other way. You can see the rock face here, the mountain just in front of us to the right. And we've got. Uh, school bus activity in the next five miles, but today being the weekend, shouldn't be a problem. Nevada DOT, Mount Charleston Maintenance Station here off to our right, according to the sign there. Probably all sorts of, uh, now we dropped to 35. Las Vegas Metropolitan Police, Mount Charleston. this traffic circle here. Trailhead Parking Spring Mountains Visitor Gateway. And a lot of folks like to come up here during the holidays especially, come up here and see snow. It doesn't really snow down in Vegas. It might snow in the periphery, but not in town, not on the Strip. I think the last time it happened was like 08, and they shut the town down because no one can drive in this stuff. 
no one knows how to drive and that stuff here in town. Forest Service Spring Mountains Visitor Gateway is closed. Gate is closed off over there. The sun is starting to get lower and lower in the sky here in this late afternoon. Check out the rock face over here. That's pretty cool, huh? And definitely much more vegetation up here. Being at this higher elevation, you get a lot more in the way of precipitation. Mount Charleston Baptist Church here on our right and the accord is going to be what is he doing i'm not sure what he just did this little building here on the left looks like it's been boarded up sealed off yeah this is just beautiful country you come up here thought that that Honda was going to like turn left, but that did not be the case, end up being the case. Nevada Scenic Byway is the sign said there, and this is definitely a scenic byway. GMC going the other way there. Well, Charleston goes straight Lee Canyon. You make a right. That way takes you out to US 95, even further north of Vegas. State Road 158. When flashing, chains or four-wheel drive with snow tires required. This being uh, non-winter. Deer crossing next three miles. Looks like a trailhead over here on our left. Got folks back there camping. See some tents back there. There's a little creek, it looks like, in there. Kyle Canyon picnic area to the left, it says there. Well, no, I mean, it's not a creek right now, but it looks like it could be when there is some precipitation. Kyle Canyon picnic area. Fletcher Canyon Trail, it says there. Off to the right. Actually, that'll give us a chance to get some separation between us and those vehicles in front of us. Wood and charcoal fires prohibited except in fee campground and fee picnic areas. So as long as you pay us, you can have yourself a little campfire. I think that's the takeaway. Fletcher View Campground, it says there, off to the left. Sorry about the view there for a moment. The sun likes to play games. More vehicles parked here. See this? And, th and in the winter, you get the snow, and this is where people will try and park. And it just becomes so crowded up here, they end up just closing the road down. Elevation 7,000 feet. And you get, you get a lot of folks trying to park on the road, side of the road and it just becomes a hazard. I don't blame anyone for coming up here. I mean, this is a beautiful part of the country. And it's nothing like what it is, what it looks like down in Vegas, for sure. I'll try and point the camera down more at the roadway there. Canyon water conditions sustainable water two days a week it says there that is not the case down in ba uh, the valley Vegas Valley 
And then you can see there's no parking there because a lot of people, again, like to park here and get out and play in the snow and stuff. It's just not safe to do. You have motor vehicle traffic right next to you like this. So Kyle Canyon Road is also known as Forest Road up here, and I think you can figure out why. All these pine trees just sprung up all over the place. It's also a good reason why there's a lot of uh, danger with fires up here. But it's a cool little community up here. Wood and charcoal fires prohibited. December through March, no parking. And again, the holidays are a huge time, so that's that's right there, prime time. They're telling you not to do it. Be out here parking on the side of the roads. Apologies for the glare there. See these rock faces immediately here off to the right. And then some, uh, some uh, civilization popping up here on our left. Some structures. Little log cabin look looking buildings. And we're back up here with this Honda. Got a fire station up here on our right. Old Town. And there is the fire station on the right. Fire station number 853 it said there. Volunteer fire station off to our left. Just beautiful. Blue skies, greenery. South Loop Cathedral Rock, which is a beautiful rock face here. Trial, a trail canyon, Mary Jane Falls off to the right. We're going to go ahead and continue to the left here. And then now in the shadows. The car says it's 74 degrees outside. Now it was 102 when we got off the highway at US 95. And we're entering a construction zone here. Road work. So we'll mind our speed. This lot up here on the left is another hugely popular place people like to come and hang out to see snow. And we've got a newer building there. On the right here at is that Forest Valley Court it says there. Elevation 7650. We've got Knotty Pine Way here. Cathedral Rock. Picnic area and trailhead. Recreation area. And then here are the little cabins right next to where the little restaurant used to be that, again, folks would come up here and eat. Mount Charleston Cabins. No public bathrooms. Cabin office. Yeah, car reads 72 degrees now. Cathedral Rock picnic area. And work zone. And that's it. You loop back around. Humboldt Toyabe National Forest, U.S. Department of Agriculture. You loop back around here. And some cell phone towers there. And that's it. It's a dead end, pretty much. So we head back westbound for a moment.
no parking next three miles, but that one parking area that I highlighted, people were definitely parking in there. So I'm going to pull into this little log cabin area here and show you where the Nevada Scenic Byway is. Um, I cannot turn in there. What about in here? Okay. No, oh, I cannot do that either. So I can't get in there. I don't know how those cars got in there. Uh, so yeah, this is a uh, this is one of the little neighborhoods up here. In this mountain town village. Hamlet, what have you. That house is being built. There's another one being built right there. Silver Tip Trail here on uh, Naughty Pine Way. Naughty like wood knots, K-N-O-T-T-Y. Apologies for the glare there. Mount Charleston Realty. Rim route. See a huge propane tank there. And this is Mount Charleston. Very, very hugely popular place up here. And then brings you back up here to Kyle Canyon Road again. With that, we want to take a much for joining. We really, really appreciate each and every single one of you. And if you haven't already, please do like, follow, and subscribe to us on YouTube and TikTok. It helps recommend us to other viewers. It helps the algorithm recommend us to others, other viewers. So please, please, please do uh, help recommend us. And uh, hopefully uh, we can help build this to a big, vibrant, thriving community. That's my goal. Um, also, the Vegas Don merch available on the shop section of YouTube with the Vegas Don logo on top of the Las Vegas Strip skyline there. Check it out for yourself or maybe a significant other. Maybe you find something in there for yourself. And uh, as always, remember to hear on the Vegas Don channel, it's the journey. We'll see you next time, folks. Be safe out there.